Okay, so we have, in that corner over there is Sugar. She's really shy of people. Somebody, I guess somebody was real mean to her. And this is Honey, who's chasing the uh, string here. I can get Sugar to do it too, a little bit. She's a little more shy. She's a gorgeous cat, though. She, if anybody gets her, they're gonna need some she's going to need some special attention. She's a nice cat, though, despite the fact she's always scared of people. We're fostering these two. Okay. And here's Missy, the goofball. If I can... <laughs> and she's got the string now. So there's honey. And there's Goongi over there who's also shy of people. I've been trying to get her. She, I, she used to let me pet her. I don't know what, what got into her. And almost right in front of her. Really old, old kitty. I had her since she was born. She was practically geriatric. <laughs> Okay. Yee. So you there to play. What I'm trying to do is use positive reinforcement. I don't know how well this is going to work. This is a, kind of a education guess. But if she associates me with food and fun, maybe she'll be less scared. <clears throat> she doesn't scratch or bite. That's the good thing. I'm going to pick her up. When I can pick her up. second here. I know my camera works not that great. I'm trying. I can turn her side. You see those beautiful markings. Ah, that's there you go. Oh, those nice shiny there. They've grown a business. We got them. It's like we were literally saving their lives. <laughs> so, especially with the winter coming up. We had uh, three other siblings with them, and they died or disappeared. I don't know what happened to them. Couldn't have been good, though. Hey, get this. Get it, get it, get it. Anyway. So he gets her, they have to know exactly what they're doing with cats and be very, very patient with sugar. Honey, she's doing great. I could pick her up, you know, I could pet her. Her eyes don't work so good, so sometimes she's a bit skittish and I have to let her smell me first before she'll come up to me. But she likes petting. This one's my shy. She won't do And I would like these two to go together as well. I are not going to get them to let them go just yet because we're going to take them, try and take them down to the vet you know, so they get fixed in their shots. We got to keep do it for a dollar with the right voucher for best friends. That's what we need is more cats. We're not trying to breed more cats. We're just trying to help with the, with the ones around the neighborhood. And we got our mom around here somewhere. Who's apparently upstairs? Looks uh, almost exactly like Honey here. Who's chasing? Him. And this is Lucky. He was supposed to be fostered, but he never left. He's actually Goongi's sister. <whistles> Hello. Be there. I can't pay attention. You should have seen her when at first she first saw this toy. She, she, her tail was so bushed out. And there's Alma, the ever the watchful nanny. She adopted these two herself. 
She got so happy. It was like, oh, babies. <laughs> so, yeah, I know you see her a lot downstairs, but she can come upstairs. She is invited, but she just chooses to stay down here. Let's see if I get her to play. I don't know if I can, but nope. Apparently not. She just likes to be petted. Anyway, anybody who's interested in adopting, just let us know. Um, if you can't find a home for them, well, they'll stay here. Let's not, we just don't need any, we just prefer that they go to a better place than we could. That's not, I don't know how to put it. Let's say, I just really think it's best for them that they get to go to another home. Though this one isn't, isn't a bad one. Right. Oh, you growling. Can you let go? Can't can you let go? Are you stuck? Okay. I'm gonna chase it. Ah under circles. I'm gonna get it. Get it, get it. Not stuck on this. Let go. Oh, you wanna try? <laughs> okay. The only thing I'm worried about with this toy is that somebody might try to eat it, and that's not good. But I'm I'm keeping watch. Well, I have to go. I'll see you.